Breaking news now at 11. Dairy Farm Inferno. Bales and bales of hay, hundreds of them in fact, burning right now in Chino. The cows at this farm covered by a halo of smoke. This fire is so intense you can see the flames for miles. Robert Kovacic is out in Chino right now for us where tonight firefighters really had their work cut out for them. Robert. Chuck and Colleen, you said you could see this fire for miles, and you certainly can. We're sitting there watching it right now with residents in this area, but we were driving up from Orange County on the 71, and we could see that blaze clearly. And as you go now to New Shopper 4 Bravo, you're going to take a look at this fire that has burning now since about 9 o'clock. This is a farm, and there are nothing right now but bales upon bales of hay that are in flames right now and what they have tried to do is move many of those bales out of the way so they can reduce the fuel level but as you see it just keeps getting bigger and it's just growing and it has burning been burning for some time as some residents have been watching it now for almost two hours and then all of a sudden we just kept watching it. It kept spreading, spreading the fires like billowing, billowing. And um, yeah, it's really scary. It's spreading really fast. Pretty scary that it's right across the street from our house. Cause like there's a bunch of houses like right behind ours too. So like I feel like a bunch of people would have that impression too. There were some cows in the area on this property, but they have been moved or have gotten themselves out of the way. We have a number of streets that are closed in and around where we are on Pine Avenue. But so far, the police have told us no evacuations are necessary. And it is very fortunate, Colleen, as we consider this fire and we consider where we're standing. And with all of these residents that are here, many of them in their pajamas. And thank you all for joining us, including this family that moved out here from Chicago. If this was a windy night here in the IE, 